Hello guys, today we will see that how you can increase your RAM speed or we can say how you can overclock your RAM. Now to check the RAM speed of your system, you need to go to task manager and select the performance tab. Now inside performance here you have to select the memory option. So right now as you can see I have 16 GBs of RAM and I am using one out of two slots available on my motherboard. The current speed is showing 2133 MHz but my RAM supports up to 3200 MHz so to use that speed I have to overclock it from my BIOS. Here I have ASUS motherboard and I am using Intel processor on it. Increasing the speed of RAM will increase overall efficiency and productivity of your system. If you are using it for gaming or for video production, the overall video rendering time and export time will reduce. Now to increase the speed, you need to go to BIOS. So first you need to restart your system. Press the delete key or F2 button. So here we have entered into BIOS. In BIOS, you need to get into the advanced mode by clicking on this option or alternately you can press F7. Now inside your BIOS, here as you can see I have ASUS motherboard. Now inside these options you have to find AI tweaker. So select this option. Now here inside AI overclock tuner, by default it is in auto. So you have to change it to XMP1. As soon as you change it to XMP1 profile, by default it will take the maximum speed available for your RAM. The maximum speed supported by my motherboard and my RAM is 3200 MHz. Next you need to save your configuration. You don't need to change any other option over here. Just press F10 on your keyboard to save this configuration and just click OK over here. So the system will restart. Now to check the speed, we will again open the task manager and go to performance, select the memory tab and as you can see the RAM speed has been increased to 3200 MHz. Now a word of caution here, in some cases if you are using two out of two slots over here and you set the RAM speed to its maximum, after making the change in your BIOS, sometimes the system might not start. In that case, what you need to do, you again need to go to your BIOS and keep it to a little bit less number instead of 3200, you can keep it to 2933. Okay, so if you are facing any such issue with your system, you can comment down below. So that's it for now. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And for more videos like this, please subscribe to our channel. Till next time, goodbye.